Hello everyone, Quick Biochemistry Basics here. Today we will talk about how the DNA is precipitated. We know that the DNA has a net negative charge because of the presence of phosphate molecules. The negatively charged phosphate interacts with the polar water molecules as a result of which the DNA remains soluble. So somehow if this interaction between the phosphate of the DNA and water is broken, then the DNA can be precipitated out of water. Well, this can be done by the addition of sodium ions. So when the sodium ions are added, well there is a problem. The force between the sodium ions and the negatively charged phosphate is very less. Why? Let's see Coulomb's law. F is equal to K Q1 Q2 by R square. Epsilon R is known as the dielectric constant. So for water, epsilon R value is AT. This means the force acting between any two charged particles is 80 times less in water as compared to vacuum. However, solvents like ethanol has a dielectric constant of 24. Isopropyl alcohol has a dielectric constant of 18. So when these solvents are added, the force between the sodium ions and the negatively charged phosphate increases. This results in electrostatic shielding of the phosphate of DNA by the sodium ions. So the DNA precipitates as the negatively charged phosphate fails to interact with the polar water molecules. Thanks for watching.